Instagram, Mark Morris, TotalVitaBroke.com. Getting ready for my tight outfit market workout tomorrow. So no more eating today after five. So cut back, oatmeal, chicken, and then I had like a one hamburger and french fries. So that's it. Then head to the gym tomorrow. Get up at 5.30. Get to the gym by 6.15. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Usually I was at Yamava Casino working um, the past three years as Christmas. So this is my first Thanksgiving off in like years. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. So I'm sitting here. I told you it would be quiet. Everyone's gone. You have a few people coming in and out. of the, But other than that, they're all at their family things having the dinner, which is great. But remember what I told you. Thanksgiving is one day, Thursday. It's not Friday. It's not Saturday. It's not Sunday. It's one day, not four days. You know why the companies close on Friday? Because people don't know how to close. This closer survival guide. If people knew how to bring in money, they would be working Friday. They'd be working Saturday. They'd be working Sunday. Instead, you're going to stay home and eat. How much food can you eat, man? That's what I'm saying. Once you have 50, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Once you hit 35, you're like, nah, you know, I'm getting a little tired of this food, man. I ain't doing something else. When you hit about 45, you're like, uh, you hit 50. Okay, enough is enough, man. I don't need to see a turkey. I don't need to see a sweet potato pie. I need to just get out there and make me some Danero so I can have Thanksgiving every day of the week. Have a, 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 a hermano. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Mark Moore, TotalBeatableBook.com. That's why we're focused on building a $10 million business. Now the push is for 60,000 subscribers. 60,000 subscribers will build a $10 million business in the next 14, 15 months. So first thing to do, get rid of, I'm getting rid of, like for your, your, your money tip for your 50 years old, getting rid of the credit cards. At least reduce the credit card to about four or $5,000. Then you, give, then you have some flexibility if you want to buy a ticket and you want to fly first class. So that's two, three thousand dollars. You have enough for a room, but you're not maxing out your credit card. So you keep your credit card under six, seven, eight thousand. So that's what I like to keep it under. Then you get your checks in, pay the credit card off. But you just don't want to run up a whole bunch of debt. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. That's money tip number one. Money up a tip or two. I told you, how do I tell you keep your grocery bill down? Write down, or at least have in your mind what you want to buy. And then you'll be more, it will prevent you from doing those impulse buys. Because my impulse buy is mostly a slice of cheesecake. Maybe you buy the Sapporo, acai, beer. So those are my impulse items. Other than that, or, may, or there may have a new cleaning product in a dentist section. Those are my impulse buy. Those three things. Other than that, you know, no more frozen food, no more refrigerated food. So everything I'm making is fresh going into 2024. So subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Number one. And number two, pay for your groceries if you can. Play with them with cash and debit. And if, my, and if you're going to pay with credit, make sure you pay that whatever you buy in the supermarket the following month before the interest accrues with cash so at least you're having like zero zero so try that subscribe so i told you how to pay off your credit cards i told you how to pay off the grocery quicker now number three you gotta go out and start selling some type of product i understand what grant says now because yesterday last year last couple of years i was working to have my main job and my side job but eventually they were too far apart this is engineering which is this is like this is retail and you know how retail is everyone's always telling you to look into their eye and you have another job that are too far apart and i had to bring them together so now i have my engineering job but now i got to bring in products and all i have to do now is you know go on the internet and be able to press it so that's all i want you guys to follow me we've gone from 146 subscribers to 372 in the last six months now we're going to see if we can't jump to 10,000. So that's going to cost probably more advertising. Keep working on the content and just keep publishing, publishing, publishing. Remember, we're going to say, we're going to accomplish. Remember, it's not what you accomplish in a day. It's what you accomplish in a year. So those are the three things I'm going to do when it comes to wealth. When it comes to health, when it comes to sex, I'm already dating one woman. And I had to get the Viagra. You either get the Viagra or get the testosterone. Get the testosterone. So I did that. So if you're a man, and then I'll give you some more options on how to keep up little Jimmy, Billy, or whatever you call it, for at least 40 to 60 minutes. 
After that, you're on your own. So subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. So that's what I'm doing for the sex. I have a double X vitamin. And then for the health, just like no more refrigerated foods, no more kind of frozen foods. If I drink mixed drinks, I only drink them at the airport. I don't mix them myself because it's just a mess, man. I woke up one day, threw up all over the bathroom and said, that's it, man. I, I ain't mixing no more drinks. And that's how thought got rid of the gut. So subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Those are my three tips for health, wealth, and sex. Let me know what you think. But remember, Thanksgiving is one day, not four days. Of these next three days, you'll be working on your goals that you're going to be doing in December and get ahead of everyone else. When they're all, oh, and they got nobody, you're going to be running like the flash. Later.